Hey YouTube. Hi YouTube. Nick the Smoking Irishman here. And Rumble B13. So. We apologize we're not smoking a pipe today. Um, I've been running around running errands and, and trying to take care of this whole job situation that's going on. And I just got off work and. So we met up and uh, to do uh, uh, a video and. We got our vapes that we have. You know, I was running around vaping. I, I keep her smoking. She was working. So we'll uh, do this real quick. Not that any of you really super care, but hopefully you do a little bit. Uh, I am vaping my K box with a Kanger mini sub tank, and inside of it, <laughs> the legend by E Vintage Liquids. And I have an I Stick 30 with an Aspire Nautilus tank. And inside that, I have Mr. Freeze. And I said that incorrectly. It's the legend by Vintage E Liquids. Good <laughs> stuff. The Mr. Freeze is, <laughs> tastes like candy games. So. Yeah, it's from a local, well, it's kind of a small little bitty chain, but it's from a local uh, vape shop uh, called Sinbad Vapors from yeah. right around here. And I think you can find them on the internet if you're yeah. really, really interested. But I don't know if they ship out, but I'm guessing they do. Yeah, because every one of their stores has a website. Yeah, so... But if you just search Simbad Vapors, you'll find them. Mm -hmm. So, uh, Rumblebee is pretty excited over here. Tell them why you're excited. I am excited because I got my very first Yabo! And it's from True Defense Chris. Yeah, I've already pre-opened it because uh, True Defense Chris believes in using tape. So, I... Uh... I didn't want to ruin anything <laughs> inside, but... So I pre-opened it because I thought it might take me a few minutes to get into it, so I don't want to waste the time with that. So Before I get into the Yabo, I want to say something that's pretty cool. True to friends, Chris has a little address label on here, and on the edge of the address label is a pipe. <laughs> and I thought that was really cute. <laughs> <laughs> so, yep, it's uh, it's uh, it's actually both of ours, and so we've got both of our names on it. But uh, True to friends, Chris set most of it for... For her. We haven't looked at it yet, so I mean I know what's in there as far as the general consensus the generality of it, but we're gonna go through it real quick with you and do true defense Chris a proper Yabo. So Thank you, Chris. I really appreciate it. Okay, so first we have Sutliff honeysuckle. I'm get a bad you glare. Get a glare so you won't be able to see it. But, but I'll hold the little baggies up so you can see. Um, Sutliff honey chocolate. Um, Boswell Berry Cobbler. Sorry. Boswell Bear Blend. Sutliff Butter Pecan. Which I'm excited about because actually Butter Pecan is one of my two favorite ice creams. The other one's Bloom. Sutliff Creamy Butterscotch. Old dark fired. Uh, that's what thing the tobacco. Is, yeah, it's, it, a it's a flake. It's a flake. I'm trying to learn the differences. And this one, he's gonna have to do because I can't say it. It's a uh, Sutliff Dolce de Leche. De Leche. Pretty sure it means milk, but I'm not for sure. Uh, so any of you out there that speak Spanish or uh, of Spanish descent that know what I'm trying to say, you can correct me if you'd like. That's cool. Yeah, I wasn't even going to try and murder it because I smoke an Irishman picks on me a lot for not being able to say you words. Don't so. pick on you. <laughs> you do. No. Pick on you means that it's me. You know, like what we do to Jeff. <laughs> well, he's not trying to be mean. He thinks it's cute, but I think it's irritating. So, but, uh, yeah, so if you haven't seen, if you haven't checked out True Defense Chris's channel, you should. Yeah, he's a good guy. He uh, does all kinds of different videos. He makes uh, a bunch of things out of pallet wood. Uh, he makes pipe stands and he makes shelves and things like that. And he also makes tampers, so you should check him out. If you're watching me, you probably already know him. But if you don't, check him out. And I don't personally know him. I mean, I've watched some of his videos and I listen to him talk on Boxer with... 
Nick and the rest of the guys, but thank you again, Chris. I really do appreciate it. And Chris, uh, I'm going to tell you, I'm not going to, I'm not going to pull throw you under the bus here completely, but uh, we were talking on Vox the other night, and you took me completely by surprise. I'm so scared. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. So I think that's all we got right now for the Yabo. We want to thank Chris for taking the time and and uh, you know the uh, you know giving us some of the things that that he has that we don't. So and that he thought that I would like, and I really appreciate that because I'm always looking for new tobaccos to try. So thanks, I really do appreciate it. Yeah, thanks a lot, Chris. Uh, so I guess as always, wherever you go, whatever you do, may the luck of the Irish be there with you. And remember, tomorrow's not always promised, so live like today might not be. Have a good day, guys. <laughs>